Hello everyone, uh, I am Dr. Sudhir. I am a pain management specialist in uh, Harion Speciality Healthcare Center. Uh, I have done my diploma anesthesia and DNB anesthesia. I have done fellowship in pain management and uh, pain management for cancer pain patients. Uh, we have shared here our contact details and our location in Tirupati city and our website and my personal email ID here and video consultation we can do in WhatsApp, Tracto and Liberate also and in social media platform we are present in all these uh, platforms regularly videos will be updated regarding so many types of pain uh, in uh, YouTube channel and uh, Twitter as well Instagram, uh, LinkedIn, Facebook and through WhatsApp Today's topic now this is like intervertebral disc now intervertebral disc is a disc which is present between two vertebras the parts include the disc itself which has got end plate end plate which is cartilaginous layer and bony layer and an apophysial ring now its fibrocartilaginous joint it is a part of motion segment of the spine and it makes up to one fourth of the length of the spinal column and uh, it is starts from C2 to C3 to until L5 to S1 it uh, is used uh, allows comprehensive tensile and rotational motion largest avascular structure in the whole body and uh, one of the parts annular fibrosis uh, as you can see this is the peripheral part annular fibrosis it's an outer portion it is made up of lamellae that is layers of collagen fibers arranged obliquely in 30 degrees and the reversed contagious layers as you can see here reversed contagious layers and uh, great strength, tensile strength whereas in center what is there is nucleus pulposus it has got its inner structure gelatinous which is and high water content and it resists axial forces this is a normal and uh, because of uh, uh, forces uh, which are uh, uh, coming in the line uh, or along the spinal uh, line uh, due to gravity or uh, because of bad uh, positioning or various uh, different types of uh, compressions it can take that uh, compressions easily because of its high water content and uh, resistance now that's a blood supply for the intervertebral disc uh, it has uh, no significant vascular structures at all and uh, if uh, they do get supply it is through vertebral body end plates okay a network of vessels uh, centrally uh, in the end plate allows nutrients to diffuse into the nucleus pulposus and annular fibrosis okay that's about intervertebral disc thank you